I don't know how well that's going to come out on tape. But he came right up to me and put his paw right on my leg. Did a little exploring the north side of the lake. I just jumped a doe over here. First deer I've seen on this trip. Somebody over there chattering at me. I think that doe is just still over there in the trees. So I pretty got pretty much got camp squared away. So I thought I'd dump all the heavy stuff and uh, like I said, just go explore a little bit. I love new places. I love old places. I just like being out here. Times like this where I like to break out the map and just practice my map skills, dust them off so to speak. So we'll just orient the map, see if I can locate that peak there, some other peaks that you can't see out of screen. And uh, it's one of the things I really like to do. Um, you know, as much, I'm a gadget person, I really am, I like electronics quite a bit. But for whatever reason, uh, I like to stick with a map over a GPS. I guess part of it's cost, weight, batteries <laughs> but uh, you know I love the GPS on my phone I love that but uh, yeah I just really prefer maps what's kind of fun about this map reading is you can kind of look at this land and get a feel for it but what you can't see is that there's a, a big river down the bottom of this canyon also uh, I might be blocking the view, but tucked back there in the corner is a uh, a pretty good sized lake for the place I'm at. I mean, they're small still, but it's just kind of fun to be able to locate things and find out where you are. Dinner time. I decided to do a bear bag up here. Um, most places I really don't. This is bear country. I have never seen one up here. But I'm starting to figure that I come up enough that I might as well lessen the percentage that it may happen. So, and I am eating away from camp. I'm not, they suggest 100 yards. I'm not quite a hundred yards. Uh, I really hate eating away from camp. I like to be in camp, I like to eat by the fire, all that kind of stuff, but I think another big reason too is uh, being that I'm up here alone, you know, when this camera's off I'm not talking, so it's just really quiet. And uh, so maybe, you know, normally voices might scare away some of the bear or other wildlife that you might be concerned with, you know, rabid squirrels. Those tend to crop up in my video every now and again. <laughs> Beef stroganoff. It's one of my favorites that they make. The mountain house. They are good. Um, I've had these on crackers too before, just to give it a little something different. That's good.
That is awesome. So I'm just finishing my dinner and I decided to come down to the lake. And I look up, sure enough, mountain goats. Um, honestly, I had no idea they were even in this area. Huh. I love this stuff, guys. I just eat this up. That one, too, that's just sitting on the ledge. He or she, they're just... Just kind of in their domain. Got a nice view of everything. Just hanging out. side of where I'm uh, camped at and I saw those two deer Looks like that's a little spike, possibly a teeny, teeny two point. The quality isn't very good right now. I've got low light and uh, I'm zoomed in as far as I can go. Yeah, he might be a little two point. A little yearling, I'm guessing, still hanging out with mom.
you doing there, little fella? Huh? Walking up on me? Yeah. You checking me out? Look at you. <laughs> he put his hands on my leg. <laughs> That's just awesome. He walked right up to me and put his paw on my leg. I don't know how well that's going to come out on tape, but he came right up to me and put his paw right on my leg. I don't know, I was just, I stood still, I didn't make any noise. I wonder if he was just curious and was like, what in the hell is this? Come up and checking me out. That is just awesome. <laughs> and one thing I really like about the ridge line versus the um, trekking poles is that it provides a place to hang items if needed. And actually guys, I'm really digging this setup a lot more than the A-frame. It's a lot more roomy. Again, it has that area up there to hang things from. 